Hello everyone, welcome to MSD. My wife wants to know what this black hose is hanging out the end of her sawmill. And what it is is a one horsepower dust collection system I hooked up to it to take it some way to clean up. And I'll show you how it works and how I designed it. What is it? A four inch hose, dust collection hose that I uh, adapted for the PVC pipe. I'll show you here. This is a PVC pipe, four inch piece. Let me get the camera here for a minute and I'll show you inside what it looks like. All I did was cut the end off from it. It's a adapter that goes over top of four inch. And then I cut the end of the saw mod where the little holes are to shoot the dust out. And I made that square box out of tin and pop riveted on there and let that stick out for the hose to command on to. And I'll show you how it works. Let me put the cover back on here. And the cover fits right over top of the piece I made. And this just turn, snaps back up on here and clamps down with a self-tightening clamp. And I got the dust collector at the other end, which I'll show you. And it's run out the building with a 5 inch hose PVC pipe coming out the back of the building. And hold on just a second and I'll go out and show you what it looks like. Excuse the vibration. This is what it is. It's set up, it's a 110, one horsepower. Then I made her a vacuum that hooks to the end of it with a PVC pipe with a regular shop vac end on it. And she can uh, clean the sawmill itself, the rails with it and everything. And I'll go out here and show you what this looks like. Where it comes out the back of the building. Way less dust inside the building. And I just got some temporary stands there. And you can see where the sawdust shoots out the back, away from the building. If all that was in the building, that's what you'd have to clean up. So since it ain't in the building, you don't have to clean it up. I just rake it away with a tractor. And I'll show you how the dust collector hooks up to the PVC pipe one, I call it. Again, excuse the vibration. Let me get the camera moved here. I'll show you how it works. And I got it on a remote control unit where she don't have to go down and switch the switch on it. It's all remote. I 
All I do is put the pipe on the wand. Tighten it down good. Turn the hose the way you want it. A little noisy. Hit the remote. And she can just come right on down the rail. Excuse the noise. Anybody's got a sawmill inside of a building like this. It's a lot less cleanup than you was outside with this dust collector hooked up. And she can even vacuum the floor. If she really wants to get technical about it, I'll show you. I put the other end of the back on. Once she drops on the floor, she can just vacuum it up. A lot less sweeping, a lot less shoveling. And keeps the building a lot cleaner. We shut that off. All right, y'all seen how that works and how I have it hooked up. If you like that, give me a like. And if you ain't subscribed to our channel, go ahead and subscribe. Got a couple more other things she's want me to show what's going on with the sawmill. Like, why is there a 12 volt battery sitting in the middle of the sawmill with a pigtail? And why is there two reese hitches on the side of the sawmill? If anybody can answer them questions, give me a shout. And also, what are these? And I'll explain to them and anybody interested, give me a shout. Get the camera back on here. All right, hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, give us a like, subscribe please. If you want to know what the other items are, keep watching the channel. I'll update you on them. Y'all have a great day.